Well, today is National Root Beer Float Day. That was the perfect excuse for Victoria Woodle to track down the history of this delish American tradition. Mm. Known as the Black Cow, the root beer float first made its appearance during the summer month of August in 1893 at a mining camp in Colorado. But did you know what came to be in the Centennial State is technically a Philly thing? Not a lot of people know that root beer originated here. Teresa Taplin is a local food historian whose contribution to the Encyclopedia of Greater Philadelphia exposes the roots of root beer and how it stemmed from the mind of a New Jerseyan living in Philly named Charles Hires. There's a story about how he was on his honeymoon and he was served root tea. He was like, this is delicious. I need to make this available to everyone. So he developed his own root beer recipe and then he turned it into a powder form. So he would sell packets of this powder and you would bring it home, add water, yeast, and sugar and make your own root beer at home. So for about 25 cents, you could make five gallons of root beer. And what he did with these packets is he sold them at the 1876 Centennial Exhibition and it was a six month long exhibition in Fairmount Park. So Charles Hires sold these packets, but he gave away root beer for free. So he'd say, come on over, have a glass of root beer, buy my packet, and it just took off. Hires then took those packets and turned them into syrups for soda fountains, perfect for ice cream floats. But remember when I told you the root beer float was invented in Colorado? Well, Teresa says there are stories that say the creation of the ice cream float really rose out of Philly in 1874. The most popular story is that in 1874 at the Franklin Institute semi-centennial celebration, a local confectioner mixed soda and ice cream together because he ran out of ice and he created the ice cream float. Wait a minute. So you're saying that, yes, the root beer float created in Colorado, yes. check that, but the ice cream float, stories say, created in Philadelphia. There's so many connections to Philadelphia. I like to think of root beer floats as a, as a Philadelphia thing. Mm -mm -mm. And what a sweet thing it is too. There's nothing like a taste of Philly. I'm Victoria Woodle for CBS3 Eyewitness News. Got that right, Tori. It's a Philly thing.